That was President Muhammadu Buhari signing Executive Order No. 6 of 2018. It borders on the preservation of assets connected with serious corruption and other relevant offenses. Speaking, President Buhari says it is time for ministries, departments and agencies to fully key into the anti-craft war, adding that those who have enriched themselves with corruption should not be allowed to enjoy their assets. We still need to strengthen our policies and the institutions in order to successfully fight corruption. We recognize that there are more grounds to cover in the war against corruption, and we are prepared to go out to possess those hands by cutting off any means that facilitates corruption and supports its growth. The president said the viability and continuous well-being of the nation faces enormous threat from corruption. He pointed out that whilst there are many reasons why Nigeria must be struggling, regrettably the most unfortunate case of great disparity between Nigeria's wealth and its populace is corruption. The president listed roles that will benefit from monies recovered from corruption cases to include the Lagos Shagamu Ibadan Dual Carriageway, the Ilorin Mokwa Jeba Bakeni Road, and the Abuja Lokoja Road, amongst others. In his remark, the Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice, Abubakar Malami, said the proceeds of corruption had been used to undermine the growth of the economy and heighten the insecurity in Nigeria. The aggregate value of funds involved in some ongoing prosecution of high-profile corruption cases stands at $595 billion, $409 834,452 Naira, 25 Kobo. Mostly, the defendants in many of the higher profile cases still have unrestricted access to these funds, and with such watches, they have made the administrative and judicial process involved in the fight against corruption rather difficult. In another development at the presidential villa Thursday, the Minister of Finance, Mrs. Kemi Adeoshun, and the Chairman of the Nigerian Governors Forum and Governor of Zamfara State, Mr. Abdulaziz Yari, met with the Chief of Staff. Their meeting centered around complaints by the Nigerian Governors Forum that the NNPC is not remitting as expected monies into the Federation account. Um, there's here because I, the President and the Minister of Finance will meet with the uh, I think NNPC official where the problem is, quantum the problems comes from, so that we resolve it and then we move with normal operation of the Federation account committee. Uh, today's meeting really was for me to brief the governors and brief the chief of staff and of course by extension the president on the, the progress we've made so far on our position um, and uh, the president has promised that he's going to uh, take the next step and uh, so for, to that extent we're very satisfied. From the Arsenal Presidential Villa, Amika Roata, ITV News, Abuja.